Scores of activists and scholars from Kenya have arrived in Ghana for a meeting called to push for greater equality in Africa. The United Nations says the gap between the rich and the poor is eroding the benefits of economic development on the continent. The meeting comes just a year before the expiry of the deadline set by the world leaders to massively reduce extreme poverty. KTN's Joa Gale, who is attending the conference, now reports. <laughs> In Dar es Salaam, the big march announces the big day, a milestone, marking 50 years since the birth of the United Republic of Tanzania. But Tanzania is only the latest country on the continent to mark 50 years of nationhood. No mean feat for a continent with a difficult past. But now it's emerging that all across Africa, most poor people are struggling to keep their heads above the water. The gap between the rich and the poor keeps growing. We dreamt about a society that would be compassionate. Yeah. A society that really made people feel they mattered. Even the UN that came up with ambitious targets in the year 2000, known as Millennium Development Goals, is beginning to have a rethink that just meeting general targets may not do. If you say the number of primary school enrollment has gone up 90%, what kind of primary school? What kind of education? What kind of teachers with what level of qualification? UN agencies and activists on the continent are now gathering for a critical conference convened by the Ghanaian government to find ways of making economic growth more even. A first step important outcome would be to encourage governments to take inequalities seriously, to understand that inequalities cannot be reduced accidentally. A lot will depend in terms of participation on the ordinary people who are either exploited or excluded themselves. They have to make a claim, they have to make demands, they have to organize themselves to assert those demands. From the west to the east, the story appears to be the same, that of a widening gap between the rich and the poor. And many experts are now warning that creating wealth alone will not lift the continent out of poverty. And time is running out. Chogeo. KTN, Accra, Ghana.